What's going on everybody? Bam Bam Johnny. Real Tree Lodge that almost flipped right. Today we're gonna open up another Elite Box supply drop from inkgaming.com. I think I got this. Oh my god, I got this. I think I got this. Did I get this? <laughs> yeah! Oh nice, Gus has a nice old style cap. I'm sorry, Gus. I apologize to Gus's kids. We were supposed to switch over to the Epic, but we forgot. So we're gonna do a fourth elite box. All right, before we get started, you can also get some of these fun play mats uh, at inkgaming.com. Like this one, we got that one, and today we're gonna to use this one. There's also a description of the link down below. I do it all the time, there's a link in the description down below. Uh, if you click on that, and then start shopping at inkgaming.com, it helps the channel out a little bit. This is actually a fairly good sized box. I can only assume they get better and better as uh, you stick with them. So maybe maybe we'll just keep on doing the Elite and we'll just order an Epic on the side. Let's see what we get here. It's been pretty fun so far. I really enjoy it. Um, okay. I guess we'll see what packs we got here. Only two packs. I wonder if there'll be some uh, a premium magic product. All right, <laughs> lots of paper. Oh, it's one pack, two packs. Okay, it's just uh, some uh, Wilds of Eldraine. Of course, these little fun inserts here. Comes with it, talks about the back of the artist. I believe these artists are the ones they team up with to make these play mats. Now, we can always use some more sleeves here, especially from Dragon Shield. All right, so I got that play mat. We'll check that out last, actually. Uh, Alright, that appears to be it. What do we got here? This is a uh, token silo convertible uh, tray here. So like you can pop these in and out and kind of uh, make whatever tray you need to hold your tokens. That's actually pretty useful. I actually will use this pretty often. So I just have all kinds of tokens and dice lying around. Alright, um, play mat. I guess we'll use this play mat. Let's see here. See, that's pretty cool. Out of the playmates we've gotten so far, this is probably my favorite. The other one is more or less the design. That's pretty neat. All right. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Of course, we got Dragon Shield. Only two boosters. Kind of wish we'd get a couple more, but it is what it is. Let's check this out. It's be a short video. I guess all the box openings for this have been pretty short. Maybe we'll pull something sweet here. Let's see what we get. Oop. That's an art card. These are Japanese packs, it looks like. All right. A little shiny boy here. And we got Utopia Sprawl. And Hilda's Crown of Winter. Crown of Winter. Eerie Interference. Archive Dragon. Not the Beanstalk. We got uh, the Gusty Explorer here. And some commons, no big deal there. Check out the second pack. Yeah, the value is a little short on these, I would say, but it's still a good gift. I think this one runs 63. Um, it's a good gift idea for somebody at least. It plays Magic the Gathering, Solitary Sanctuary, and Defense of the Heart. Defense of the Heart for Mythic number one. And The Apprentice Folly. No big deal. Tempest Heart. Collector's Fault. It's Frolicking Familiar. And some comments. Well, there you have it. Elite Box number four. Still pretty fun. Value's a little rough, but fun to open still. Bam Bam Johnny, Real Tree Lodge. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already.